Vincent here in the studio, and, and Jill Cush is, is teching the show. Glad to have Jill as tech. I'm in the same room as these wonderful musicians here. Um, I did want to start out mentioning from the Stars of Tomorrow show that happened uh, earlier um, this year. Um, there was some clogging that was going on that was really fun, and there was an event happening this Friday at the Lincoln Center, Friday, May 17th, called Let's Dance. It will be a mix of clogging uh, dance, lyrical, ballet, hip-hop, and just an all-around incredible evening of the best talent that High Country Conservatory of Dance has to offer. It's going to be a show like no other. So again, happening this Friday, May 17th at the Lincoln Center, and their website would have ticket information there. Hello, you young musicians, you two. Hello. Sammy Davison, nice to see you here. Nice to see you too. And I think the last time that you were at KRC, you were actually part of uh, Andrea Bradstreet uh, invited the two of us on the Rocky Mountain mm-hmm. Breakdown show, and we talked to her for about 20 minutes live on the radio. That was really fun. Yeah, it was a great experience. And you did really extremely well. She was completely um, impressed with you. And we're also going to hear the music of uh, Max. And by the way, we're recording this. This is very interesting. Max Williams. Yeah. See, it's just the name. It's like Max. People are like, oh, you know Max? I don't even have to use the last word, <laughs> name anymore. Um, you're going to be, we're recording this on Sunday. So uh, people listen to this on Monday, the day before. We're here in the Green Studio and we're going to talk about some fun stuff going on with you. For example, you are going after this. We're all going to go over to um, Avogadro's number. Yeah, five years the Gremlins have been together. That's astonishing. As well as the Lincoln Jam with Adam Grosso directing that. Yeah, I'll be there too. So really fun. We're going to start out with uh, Sammy's music here. And Sammy, let's do this. Let's actually go straight into your first song. You have two instruments that you're playing today. You're geared up with your mandolin. And you're also going to be playing some fiddle music. Yes. So with the mandolin, we have well-known song Cripple Creek is the first song that you're going to hear. This mm-hmm. is Sammy Davison, and you are nine years of age. Go to Laura Elementary here on the Rhythms of Youth Show. Awesome job, Sammy. You know, we're recording this on Mother's Day. This is really cool. Yes. And uh, Max's mom is in here, Susan Williams, an incredible mom in town here. I want to say happy Mother's Day to you and all of uh, the mothers. Jill is a mom. Grace is hanging out in the studio. Your daughter, Grace, is in the studio. And so happy Mother's Day. Every day is Mother's Day. So this is really a fun, beautiful day here in Fort Collins, Colorado. And some really talented musicians in town, as we've all come to know and, and appreciate, and we're going to continue uh, with Sammy, and I want to talk a little bit about what you've been up to with your music, Sammy. So what happened was, um, I'm pretty sure before I was even born, they started a music program, and um, somebody agreed to um, teach the kids violin and fiddle, and um, they had about 12 kids start and then it got bigger and bigger, and then more people took over, and um, finally, um, my violin and mandolin teacher took over, and he teaches different styles of music. He teaches violin, which is mostly Suzuki, fiddle, which is mostly bluegrass, and um, he also teaches mandolin. Yeah, Mr. Chad Fisher, and we're going to be hearing more about that. That's really well put, Sammy. And it's so cool because I'm remembering the first time that I met you, and I met Ben the same day. Mm. Ben Koenig. 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 Something like that. He's <laughs> <laughs> got all these vowels in it, but it's it, Ben is amazing as well. So mm-hmm. let's go into your next song, Sammy. Okay. Lynch Mountain Backstep is the name of this song.
Nice job, Sammy. Sounded great. Mm-hmm. You know, the mandolin is really uh, taking off, I think, the past couple of years as a musical instrument, would you say? Yeah. Um, and that goes into another thing about the music program at my school. Mr. Fisher, he was starting to teach mandolin, but only for the third, fourth, and fifth graders until me and Grace wanted to do it. And so. And you were in second grade at the time? Yes, end of first grade, second grade, something like that. Right, you were at the end of first grade, right? Yeah. You are just a little kid back then. <laughs> yeah, and so we really wanted to stop playing. And so Grace found a mandolin, and I found a mandolin. And we asked Mr. Fisher to teach us, and he said, yeah, sure. And so me and Grace were the first, second, and first graders to play mandolin. Yeah, and that's really fun. And he mm-hmm. is also, um, there's a funding project for Chad. He was invited, selected to go to a mandolin symposium. Yes. And he's looking for funding for that. And I know that that information would be on his Facebook page, Chad Fisher, F-I-S-H-E-R. Right. So that's really cool. Mm-hmm. Help out Chad on his trip. It's a pretty great selection for him to be chosen to go to that. So it'd be great to see the community come together so he can uh, reach that goal. Yes. Cool, Sammy. We're going to continue with your music. And again, this is Sammy Davis, and Sammy is a Laurel Elementary student, part of the um, Laurel Elementary Fiddle and Mandolin program with Mr. Chad Fisher. And again, when he started this program, I took it over. I think there were about 42 kids or something, and now there's over 170, I believe. Yes. So great job he's doing out there. It's really, And he's gone from being a part-time uh, teacher with a kiosk, going from room to room, and now he has his own room. And Uh, things are really hopping Mm -hmm. with with that program over there. It's pretty incredible. This next song with Sammy Davison on mandolin is Little Liza Jane. Liza Jane, oh little Liza, little Liza Jane. I know a girl from Baltimore, little Liza Jane. I know a girl from Baltimore, little Liza Jane. Nice job, Sammy. Thank you. You sang that one. Mm-hmm. That's cool. You know, the first time you sang, actually, was in, it, at Channel 10, because Pooter School District, you were record, filmed over there recently, and you sang yes. a song. Yes, I mm-hmm. sang Jingle Balls. That's right. It was a holiday mm-hmm. edition that we did over there. Nice job. Nice to add vocals to your uh, your growing repertoire, Sammy. Thank you. We're listening to Sammy Davison on the Rhythms of Youth Show, CARE FC 88.9 FM, and later in the second half, uh, second half of the hour, we're going to be hearing from Max Williams, who's 15 years of age, a uh, member of the group The Gremlins, celebrating their fifth year anniversary this summer. It's really exciting. And um, we're going to be coming up with that. So great to have Max in here. And let's keep the music going. Now, this Old Joe Clark mm-hmm. is one of three songs that you wanted to specify about. Okay. These three songs are for my mom. They are her favorite songs. And... This song is called Ojo Clark, and she always used to um, mess up the name, and she was like old, grumpy old Apple Clark, and and so I had to make her a hat that said, that had it in front of, um, that had a sticky note hanging in front of it that said Ojo Clark, and um, this became one of her favorites. Sammy Davison.
Nice job, Sammy. Thank you. Really nice job. Yeah, I've heard you perform that song a few times, and you get better every time you play it. Thank you. Really nice. Now, this is interesting. We have um, a final song on your mandolin, and then it's really cool because we're going to transfer instruments. You're going to play fiddle, and you're going to play that same song on fiddle. Yes. I think that's really unique. That was a great idea you had. Thank you. Yeah. This is Sammy Davis, and this is Minuet 3. Nice job, Sammy. Thank you. That's a beautiful pick for a song. It's cool going from, uh, you know, the bluegrass music mm-hmm. into a classical piece like that. It's really yeah. nice diversity there. So we're gonna um, we're gonna switch up instruments. Sammy Davison here with us, moving on to um, fiddle music. We are going to um, after Sammy set be hearing music from Max Williams, who is over at Rocky, a freshman over at Rocky. And um, Max is it's interesting. He's he's getting into the songwriting realm today. We're going to be hearing some really fun covers from uh, songs of folks that you've definitely heard of and some really great picks there as well. And the Gremlins are really uh, the band that's celebrating five years, really a rock-infused band, really looking to The Who and similar bands for inspiration. So um, really looking forward to that. So um, Sammy now has this fiddle lined up. And Sammy, before we hear your first song, tell us about that incredible fiddle and where that came from. After I finished Suzuki Book 1, which is the um, first book that Mr. Fisher teaches. And you just finished that a few weeks ago, right? Yes, um, about a month ago. And um, my parent, I've been wanting my own violin for a while. And because the ones that you get at school, um, they are donated from another music program. You get them totally free. You get lessons for free and everything, but I want my own violin. And so my parents said, once I finished Suzuki Book 1, and I did my recital, my parents would get me my own violin. And so they kept their promise, and um, right before the recital, um, they took me down to Denver, and we went to the Egan's Violin Shop, and um, they bought me my own violin. It's a very special violin. It's from China. And it's very nice. That's really sweet. Yeah, it's two feet from my where I'm sitting here. This is really mm-hmm. nice. Hey, maybe when you finish book two, they'll they'll buy you a fiddle. <laughs> a little musical joke there. Mm-hmm. Same instrument, of course. Cool, Sammy. So let's go into this now. We're going to hear the song that we just heard. Yes. On mandolin, on this wonderful violin. Violin. Fiddle. Fiddle.
Nice job, Sammy. Thank you. That's really great. Cool. Wow, a classical mm-hmm. piece. So we're going to kind of move into the, the bluegrass music. How do you kind of compare the two styles of music? Um, well, the, um, the violin music is more, um, is more, like, it's not a tune that you could dance to. Well, you could, but. It would yeah. be a different kind of dance, huh? Yeah. You have to, like, wear fancy shoes and stuff, huh? Mm-hmm. And, um, I have a, um, I have two teachers, um, my viol, my, mostly my Suzuki and classical um, teacher. And who's that? Miss Jefta. And, oh, Jefta Bernstein. Yes. A project pitch. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's a, she's mm-hmm. an incredible lady. Yes. And then, um, my more bluegrass teacher is Mr. Fisher. You've got two world-class teachers there, young lady. <laughs> yes. Telling you, you do. Well, nice. Well, we're going to go into mm-hmm. some more music with Sammy Davison, uh, nine years of age here from Laurel Elementary School, part of the wonderful Chad Fisher's Fiddle and Mandolin Club out there. Mm-hmm. And we're going to hear Boiling Cabbage Down from Sammy. That's great, Sammy. Thank you. That's a barefoot dance, the song. No fancy shoes in that one. Yeah. That's awesome. Wow, that's really fun. What a great uh, change-up of, of styles. It's really, yes. really great. It's a great place for both styles, you know? Yeah. That's really neat. Now, this next song that we're going to hear um, on KRFC 88.9 FM is one of the three uh, of your mom's favorites. Yes. Soldier's Joy. So, happy Mother's Day to my mom. Sammy, that was a great job. Thank you. you you're you very much an authority. You have an air of authority about you playing that. Thank you. And that song was also played on, um, well, our school had a square dance on Friday night. You did. And um, we played three songs with a band, and those were, since um, those were Liberty, Soldier's Story, and... Another song that I can't think of the name of right now. It's okay. It'll come to your head. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was a cool event you had out there. Square dance. Yeah. And we learned how to square dance. And um, it was just really fun. Absolutely. You're getting a lot of um, performing. You seem pretty fearless out there. Thank you. Yeah. Now this next song is also one mm-hmm. of your mother's three favorites. Yes, Cincinnati Hornpipe. Thank you. 
Wow, nice job. Thank you. I think that song is my favorite, actually. <laughs> it, it's, it's really got something going yeah. on. All of them do, but that, that one really stood out for me. That's really nice. It's also my dad's favorite. Ah, great minds think alike, huh? <laughs> so we're going to hear two more songs from Sammy coming up, music mm-hmm. with Max Williams. And I have not heard of this next song, Gabbit. Gavat. 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 <laughs> it's the last song in Suzuki Book 1. Oh, wow. That's an epic song for you. Yes. This is Sammy Davis. rather astonishing young lady thank you sammy davison here with us that's that's a terrific um thing you got going there with your instruments thank you really really something it doesn't hurt that you have world-class instructors either <laughs> jeff de bernstein and chad fisher mm-hmm. uh really really kind of amazing stuff going on here sammy has one more song for us and i i hesitate to try to pronounce this adam a adam oh and okay well it's a d o m e so i i from my previous attempt, I thought I would try to get that correct, but I was close. And I wrote this song. You wrote this song? Yes. Wow. That's incredible. So mm-hmm. is the, this is my, um, this is a, a, our world premiere of your original song. Is that correct? Yes. Yeah, yes. You haven't played this before, have you? No. Wow. This is Sammy Davison. Sammy is um, at Laurel Elementary School, nine years of age, and this is an original song by Sammy.
Let's hear it for Sammy. (laughs) Really a pleasure to have you back in here, Sammy. Thank you. And um, Sammy Davison, Mm -hmm. just doing some great things and continue to learn that music. That was a really fun original song. Nice job. Thank you. And I want to give a shout out. uh, Thank your, your parents for being so supportive of what you're doing as well. Mike, thanks for being in here, Mike. Thanks. Yeah, just um, great things happening here in Fort Collins with the youth music scene. And you, young lady, you get to kick back and watch this incredible performer, second incredible performer of the day here in the studio here. So thanks, Sammy. Mm-hmm. Nice job. Thank you. Bye. You are listening to KRFC 88.9 FM, the Rhythms of Youth Show. I want to thank uh, Jill Cush for doing this uh, tech work ongoing and uh, really fun for me. I get to hang out in the the identical room as these performers now, which is really fun. Hello, Max Williams. Hi. Max, you are a pretty busy guy with your music. You're playing acoustic guitar with us today. Yep. You, it's just worth noting that you and Riley, your brother, and Aiden, you were the ones that um, told me about the Channel 10 studio, <laughs> which I love to mention because it's pretty fun. That's been ongoing now since September of 2010. We've done over yeah. 35 shows now. And uh, you had performed over there prior to my knowledge of the station when you won the um, contest at Everyday Joe's. How far back does that go? Oh, um, that was sixth grade, I believe. 2010. You're ninth grade now. Um, Yeah, it was a long time ago. You're a freshman at Rocky now. Yes. And five years the Gremlins have been together. Dang, I haven't even thought of it like that. Yeah, and you're a freshman. And you guys have stuck together. And, of course... There's some really funny stories about you getting Riley into music, and it's like you, you knew you needed a drummer. So like, like Riley, your younger brother, that's <laughs> yeah, what you're gonna learn. I told him that he was gonna play drums. I didn't really give him a choice. Yeah. Well, look at him now. He's learning jazz drumming from Oscar of the group Zaro, and uh, you guys incredible. are making really, really great music. So we're gonna go into um, the acoustic thing today because you play with an incredible tone with the Gremlins, your electric guitar. I mean, you really turn heads, and it's it's amazing that you. Um, how good you sound when you play. It really is. Thank you. And singing, which we'll hear now, this first song you're going to play, uh, Lithium by Nirvana. Yeah. I'm so happy. 
be Just today I found my friend In my head I'm too ugly And so gay So are you Broke our bills Sunday morning Is every day For all I care And I'm not scared Light my candles In a days Cause I'm found good Like it, I'm not gonna cry. I miss you, I'm not gonna cry. I love you, I'm not gonna cry. I killed you, I'm not gonna cry. Nice job, Max. Thanks. That's awesome. Um, worth mentioning, and Sammy, who played previously, both of you artists will be playing at Ben and Jerry's this summer. Yes. That's something um, put on by Care FC and the Rhythms of Youth show. Mm -hmm. Uh, Hopefully 18 hours a week out there all summer for 11 weeks, uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday from 2 to 8 p.m. That's going to be really fun. Both of you are actually playing on Tuesday, I believe. Uh So that's going to be really nice acoustic music happening out there as well. Let's go into more music. This is Max Williams, who's a freshman over at Rocky and you've got quite the music scene going over at Rocky Young Man. Yeah, we do. This is Crash by the Dave Matthews Band. Guessing about you, got your chain Signs on tie and time me up again Who's getting close in you, my friend Until your heart I'll be again Sweet like candy to my soul Sweet you rock and sweet you own Lost for you, I'm still Coming to you in a boy's dream, in a boy's dream. So to live this, so I know. Look in your eyes, or it goes so. I'm very born crazy, it's for you I go crash into me Baby, I come into Time so tight, time me up again Get me close in you, my friend Until your heart I'll be again Sweet like candy to my soul Sweet you rock and sweet you roll Lost for you, I'm so lost for you Right on, Max Williams. Good job, buddy. Thanks. Um, Now, again, the Gremlins are um, celebrating your fifth anniversary this month. That's pretty remarkable. Yeah, it is. I can remember it like yesterday. We started um, off at the Dunn Talent Show back in fourth grade. (laughs) 
Uh, Riley was in second grade. He was. He's in seventh now. He's and Yeah. It was a long time ago. It's, it really was. doesn't seem like it, though, at all. Well, I think for any band, like a rock band, to stick together for, for that length of time is really an accomplishment. You know, I mean, it kind of helps that your your brother lives in the same house. So as far as like <laughs> it helps practice times, but, yeah. <laughs> Aiden probably lives pretty close too. Would you say? Yeah, he, he can bike over. And the fact that it's a trio, maybe a little bit easier than if you had five guys in a band, logistically to get everybody it's together and to all put that. Everything together, yeah. But I think it's safe to say you are. I mean, you're the leader of the band, and it was fun because recently I watched um, on YouTube your performance server at Everyday Joe's. Which was in, I think, 2010. Are we talking yes. about? Yes. No, the Stars of Tomorrow. Uh, it wasn't the Stars of Tomorrow. That was a little different. No, not Stars of Tomorrow. What was it? Youth in the Spotlight. Youth in the Spotlight. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's cool that we we're getting mixed up these I mean, opportunities yeah. for youth. Oh, is it this one or that one? It's like they're yeah. out there. So that's really good. Um, and one of the and you did win that, and you actually played a, a original song called uh, Thumb. Thumb Walker. Thumb Walker, which is very <laughs> funny. Which Riley came up with the name of that. Yes. When he saw hitchhikers, he called them thumb walkers. It used to drive me nuts. He used to call cows bears, and I'd get so pissed. <laughs> <laughs> That's too funny. Um, and Riley's learning. Riley's starting to sing also. Yes, we're starting to give him a little more control. We actually had the Lincoln Jam <laughs> over at Channel 10 Studios last week with Adam Grosso. Yeah. And uh, really great to see all those guys. Really eclectic. And... Um, Today, later today, this being recorded on Sunday, both bands, Lincoln Jam and the Gremlins playing over at Avos. Yeah. Avos has been a huge supporter of what you guys do. Yes, we've done quite a bit at Avos and they've been great, great support. Yeah, great Rob's a great guy. Them. Really good guy. Yeah. We're hearing some great music from um, Max Williams today. We want to thank again Sammy Davison, who played earlier in the show, hanging out with us as well. And this is a fun song, Creep, by the Stone Temple Pilots. Yeah. Someday, oh, it makes me want to stay. When the sun wins, we go, oh, it makes me want to stay. Living on the house, guess I'm living on the house. I'm saying, God's sign, got no meaning, just a rhyme. Time we don't behave, cause the light's still on. Same time we don't behave, cause the light's still on. Same time we don't behave, cause the light's still on. And light's still on. Half a man used to be, a year as the dawn face gray. Glad I used to be. Fear as the dawn fading gray. Fear the night's fire, oh, thing and go start a fire. Everybody run, oh, Bobby's got a gun. Think you're kind of me. Then she tells me I'm a creep Friends don't mean a thing Guess I'll leave it's up to me In time with only hair Cause the eyes heal In time with only hair Cause the eyes steal Time with whom we here Cause the light's still I light still I'm half the man I used to be Feel as the dawn facing gray Half the man I used to be Is the dawn facing gray Time with 
Cause it likes you Sing time with one day Cause it likes you Sing time with one day Cause it likes you And I still I'm happy man And used to be Beards on face and gray Half a man I used to be Half a man I used to be Half a man I used to be Nice job, Max. Thank you. That's great. It's funny, the first three song titles, Lithium, Crash, and Creep. <laughs> Very connotative. It's funny, but we're going to hear Better Man yes. from Pearl Jam next. And it's interesting. You were um, hitting some low notes there that maybe a little while ago you wouldn't have been able to hit. <laughs> it's an interesting aspect of your age where guys' vocals are really uh, changing. So you have to kind of be proactive and adapt to that somehow. A lot. It's kind of confusing because you'll, yeah, you get to a point where you can't do some of the songs. And we've come to that point with the Gremlins where. Some of our songs got too high for me to sing. Oh, that's very but, interesting. Uh, we've we've coped with it pretty well. So yeah, yeah, and that was a really nice variation that you did on "Creep." There, that was really well done. You kind of made it your own song, which is what it's all about, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. Cool. Well, we're having a great time here with Max Williams, and we are going to. Um, I wanted to actually touch upon the Gremlins' next gig, which you're a part of, of course, at Odea Elementary School. Yes, um, that is the triathlon. We did not do this last year because I think I broke my wrist. Yeah, that was. I remember you did. A very you're, bad you're all month healed. for me. Yeah, it was right at the end of my middle school career, and I missed uh, quite a few things that I wish I hadn't musically, and you know, a lot of other things that I had, could have done. But we're gonna do it this year. And, uh, yeah. That's going to be on June 1st, which is a Saturday. And your mother, Susan, happy Mother's Day again, is a teacher over there. She is. She's the best teacher over there. <laughs> <laughs> so you can Google O'Day Triathlon, O apostrophe D E A Triathlon, to find out more information about the, de you know, the details about that. Yeah. That's awesome. Cool. Well, we're going to now hear Pearl Jam song, one of my, uh, personal favorite bands with Eddie Vedder vocals and this is Max Williams with Better Man All right. Waiting Watching the clock is four o'clock. You got to start. I'm telling, saying no more. She practices the speech and then he opens the door. She rolls over. She starts to sleep as he looks over. She lies and says she's in love with him. Can't find him, better man. She dreams in cold and she drinks in red. Can't find a better man. Can't find a better man. Can't find a better man. Talking to herself, there's no one else who needs to know else herself. Oh, memories back when she was bold and strong and waiting for the world to come along. She swears she knew, and now she swears she's gone. She lies and says he's in love with him. Can't find a better man. She dreams in colors and dreams in red. Can't find a better man. Can't find a better man. Can't find a better man.
Nice job, Max. We're having a great time here here in Max Williams' music. Really great to have you back in the studio. It's been it's been a little while, I think. It has been a while. Yeah. When was the last time we were here? Maybe I think it's been like about a year. Probably. Wow. Yeah, we you've been a busy guy, <laughs> and it's cool to um, you know see you. Typically, when you're performing in public, you're playing electric guitar. Yeah. It's a wonderful tone. Um, here, it's nice to have you come in as an artist. Maybe nice to try something a little different where you are doing the acoustic thing. For, for yeah, it's. Uh, I started doing a lot of acoustic about three years ago, probably. And before that, I did probably completely electric guitar. Um, I started doing that. I started songwriting. And uh, it, it's been really fun. It's been a fun hobby. And hopefully I can get to do more of it later on in my career so absolutely yeah i'd love to see that and it's exciting that you're beginning to write songs and so forth and <laughs> well it was interesting you mentioned earlier the stars of tomorrow it wasn't this past one but the one prior to that you played an original song i think it was called fly uh soar soar close <laughs> and and you won your division with an original song yes. that was really impressive really great so uh we're gonna hear a final song from max and i wanted to uh just mention again both sammy davison who was on the show earlier hanging out with us and you on uh tuesdays will be out at ben and jerry's yes. uh at least for the first five weeks of the summer and we're going to yeah. continue it, the music out there all summer long for 11 weeks monday tuesday wednesday from 2 to 8 p.m really excited that both of you are going to be involved in that and it's called cream of the crop being ben and jerry's and <laughs> the two of you both certainly are so it's, it's really awesome to have you here we're going to hear a final song um made popular by Nirvana, but originally written by Lead Belly. And I just want to make a, a comment. If folks have not, you, I think you can YouTube Lead Belly. Talk yes. about a powerful singer. I, I was completely floored the first time, well, on the second and third, yeah. that I heard Lead Belly sing. You're doing a version of a Lead Belly song, Where Did You Sleep Last Night? Yeah, I like to uh, dedicate this one to my mom because she's the one who showed us this one. She's the one who brought home the Nirvana live MTV. Nice guy, concert, Susan. So. <laughs> Susan and Mark, like, pretty cool parents you've got going there, yeah, Max. Pretty cool parents, sure. <laughs> Wind blows 
in the past In the past where the sun don't ever shine And I'll shiver the whole night through Awesome to have you here, Max. Thanks for having me. Max from uh, Rocky High School. And now the Gremlins actually have a Facebook page now. Yes, we do. Thank you, Meg Dunn. Would, yeah, Meg's done a lot of uh, great things for the group. Would you, would you recommend that's the number one way that people find out about upcoming stuff with you and learn more about your group? Uh, probably the most updated. <laughs> is it The Gremlins or Gremlins? It is. I don't really know. Well, we could check it's, out It's both. pretty new, yeah. but uh, it'll, it'll be there. Yeah. So really appreciate you being here, and it's really fun because straight from this recording, ending in a moment here, we're going <laughs> to... 15 minutes. You've got something going on at Avos with yeah. the Lincoln House, Lincoln Jam, and then uh, the Gremlins, which you'll be playing with. So that's really wonderful. So thank you. And I also want to thank Sammy uh, from Laurel Elementary being here as well. Really nice to have you here, Sammy. Speaking of Laurel Elementary, there's a hand drum group called uh, The Volcanoes, and we recently filmed them out at Channel 10. That is now airing on Comcast Channel 10, the Volcanoes, Lincoln Hand Drum Group. Thank you all very much for listening to the show. Have a great day. Thanks, everybody.